I predicted this months and months ago. I said something is going to happen over there. Diane Radishat, president of her Senior Living Community Association at Shag Arrowhead Gardens, is talking about the possible homicide Seattle police are investigating. That's why I'm angry. <laughs> it's exactly why I'm angry. It happened Tuesday night in this homeless encampment across the street from the retirement community. We have as much concern for their safety and their welfare as we have for our own. Older people are scared to come out their houses now in the dark. King 5 was here last month. Residents shared their concerns and fears. Diane leading the charge by reaching out to city and state leaders. Governor Inslee, Mayor Harrell, uh, Captain Diaz, and explain to them what was going on. And Ultimately, WashDOT is the government agency responsible for cleaning up this property. You need to come here and meet with these residents. You need to come here and do your job. In an email response to our questions, WashDOT says several steps have to be taken for them to clean up the property. Shelter and services must be offered to people living at the encampment, their belongings must be stored, and it must be safe for work crews to clear the area. Only then can WashDOT clean up the property. Right now, there are no immediate plans to clear the area, a lack of movement that disappoints Diane. We're criticizing the situation. We're not criticizing the humans. Those are two different things. After receiving emails from the city, WashDOT, and the King County Regional Homelessness Authority, I'm gonna be responding back to all of them on one email to see if we can get a timeline laid out on when the encampment will be cleaned up. Live in South Seattle, Cornelius Hawker, King 5 News.